Hello, my name is Breed Madden and this is my sister Mar and we're from the Earthline College in Sligo Town. And for our project we have developed a portable charging station that alerts to overheating of any electrical devices. One of our phones overheated while it was charging. Breed had her phone under her pillow overnight, which is a major safety hazard. So it overheated and we wanted to see was this a big problem. So we searched online and our uncle was a fireman and he said that he attended over 150 fires in 20 years with electronic devices in a small area, Tubber Curry and Sligo. So we said we investigated it further and we conducted a survey of sample size 510 to see if overheating was a big problem in Ireland and we found that 48.1% had a device that had overheated and 20 had a device that caught fire. So we decided it was time to build a device. We decided to build a prototype for our device then which we did a coding, since we're amateur coders we just started learning how to code. We looked up loads of videos online to help us with the coding and to help us with the circuitry to make the device work. You put your device on the copper sheet and there's a silicone mat under it to absorb the heat and the prototype, but the actual device will have a lid on it with silicone as well so if the device does catch fire the surrounding area is safe because the box is fireproof. So when a maximum temperature is exceeded the alarm goes off and it goes to the phone, an app on your phone to say your device is overheating and it says it then on the computer as well. What can be used for laptops, smart watches and we also found electrical equipment to monitor the plugs of hair straighteners or Christmas tree lights because it monitors the socket temperature as well if you were to put a temperature sensor on the socket as there's an extension lead in the box. The closest thing to on the market is fire mold so it just monitors the temperature of the plug. It doesn't actually monitor the temperature of the device and it doesn't have an app coded to it. It just is an alarm so if you weren't in the house you wouldn't get the data sent to your phone.